tuition fees at Tunku Abdul Rahman University College, Tar UC, next year will see a slight increase after being adjusted for inflation. MCA President Datuk Sri Dr. Wika Siong on Sunday assured that the fee adjustment will be minimal, adding that students will still receive affordable education at Tar UC. Every year, all the students will have some inflation adjustment. We will have a small amount of fees. Dr. Wee said that it was important to first look at the fee structure of Tai UC, which is the cheapest among all private higher institutions of learning. Uh,大家很担心的是如果缺少三千八百万,那我们是不是一下子呢,要相当大的幅度,所以我跟大家派一个定心丸,不会。不会,它会是一个的,呃,相当,呃,幅度不大的一个调整。Earlier, Dr. Wee was one of the key panelists at a briefing and forum on the government's allocation for Ta UC. Other panelists included Party Vice President Datuk Yu Tiong Luk, Datin Paduka Tan Siok Chu, and lawyer Kam Tar UC Alumni Association former committee member Marcus Tan. On December 6, it was announced in Parliament that the government will only provide the institution with a development fund of 5.5 million ringgit, but not the 30 million ringgit matching grant. The matching grant is a commitment made to MCA by the previous administration to ensure that the institution continues to offer quality education to the young. Finance Minister Lim Guan Eng reportedly said that MCA should break its ties with University Tunku Abdul Rahman, UTAR and Tar UC before the government could provide more allocation for the two institutions. Dr. Wee described the decision as cruel and reiterated that MCA will not break ties with the institutions that have been professionally managed without any political influence.